Okay, guys, we've got a battle against Garchomp it up! Yay! No. No. I, yeah. I, I... <sighs> okay, so, uh, this is a very interesting battle, and I think this is the first battle with my random, random team changes, and I finally booted out Gallade, and I booted out, um, Evi, even though he has done pr a pretty good work over the last couple of battles, but I booted him out. Got in, uh, yeah, like I say, Houndoom, Glade, uh, I've got in Kingdra, which is now Scarfed. I think those are the main changes. Celebi is a bit more offensive. Anyway, he leads off with a Pharaoh and I lead off with Bronzon, which pissed me off because I was so going to lead off with Houndoom. And uh, we both Stealth Rocks, and I'm going to switch into Houndoom just so I can say, can you, Sir, can you please just fuck off? I'm not dealing with you. I don't want any. Get out. So he's going to switch out and go into Latios, and I go Fire Blast. I was tempted to Dark Pulse, but I'm a pansy, I didn't want to. But now I Dark Pulse, and he... What? My Dark Pulse, A, didn't kill, and B, he... Yeah, the fuck. The fuck! Props to him for using something original, though, so I'm not going to complain. It's, it, it's cool. I just didn't expect it. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah. Hidden Power Ice doesn't kill him either, so this is one freaky, bulky Latios, and he sidekicks and dies after a while. So that's that down. That was pretty cool, though. I'll give him credit where credit's due. I would never see that one coming. But in comes a Tornadus, and um, I switch out and go into Bronzong, and he goes Air Slash, and I wasn't entirely sure if Tornadus got it, but I did check. It does get it. And that's, you know, I was a little bit worried. It's like, hang on, the Latios took hits like a trooper and this thing has Air Slash. What's going on? But yeah, I'm just, yeah. So, it, it's fine. It is allowed. It does get it. It's quite, I don't know why more people use it then. Everyone spams Tornadus in raid with, like, Hurricane. But he's going to U-turn out. And he's going to go into, uh, I'm not saying it. Toad your kiss. Not toad your derogatory word for a black person. Sorry, I don't like racism. Anyway, he T-waves me, and he's the T-wave air slashing set, so, yes. How joyous. He's going to aura sphere me for no apparent reason. It, yeah. He powers up my gyro balls, and then he doesn't even start trying to flinch me. I'm not complaining. Oh, I am complaining. Oh, now he goes for the flinch. What, what's the point? Either way, he'll block his screwing him over. I'm just going to go into Kingdra. Kingdra is scarfed. I don't care. I can hit and power fire him and take him out. This is also good if he wants to go into Ferrothorn thinking he's a beast. Which he just does. And I'm like, oh la 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 la, oh la la la, lol, hidden power fire to your face. So he just sets up another layer of spikes and then thinks, well, fuck, this sucks. Uh, I didn't see that one coming at all. In fact, I don't know why he didn't think that one through. But now he's going to go into Landorus as I go for another hidden power fire. I get a little bit more damage on him. And, um, I don't really want to hang around. It's kind of a waste of my Kingdra. So I'm going to go into Bronzong, because I know I can take shit decently well. But he has a special Landorus, and he fires off a Focus Blast and kills off my, um, Bronzong. So I'm going to go into Celebi, hoping I can take it, or hoping he'll U-turn or something. And, um, he just switches out, goes into his, uh, Metagross as I go for a Hidden Power Ice. And, um... Yeah, it ain't looking too good. He goes bullet punch, which made no sense to me, because he had le you know, he had the leeway to just start um, mashing, but for some reason he went bullet punch, and now I'm pretty much back at the same amount of HP I was before. I'm going to go into Whizcash. Oh, yes. Now, here, I was tempted to DD. I was. But I figure if I over if I mispredict, he screws up. That and Landorus' scarf is going to be quicker. I'm just going to go Waterfall, predicting the Landorus or the Tornadus. And lo and fucking behold, after waiting, come on, he goes into Landorus. I nail it, I KO him. Whiskash doesn't even need to DD to do work. Because he is so good with the, the, the fishy. He, he's, he's awesome. He really is. Uh, shine on, you crazy Whiskash. Anyway, he's going to bring in Tornadus, and I don't really want my Whiskash to take too much damage, because I know it can deal with um, Gross, so I'm just going to sack Celebi, get a bit more Life Orb damage on him. Now I can go back into Kingdra, I can hit him Power Fire again, take the Tornadus out. If his Gross didn't have Bullet Punch, I would be good to go at this point, but it does. So he's going to bring the gross in, he's going to bullet punch me, and then I'm going to go into Whizcash. 
And uh, you can guess what Whizcash is going to do. I was kind of worried that Gross would actually be quicker than the Whizcash, but um, I think my Whizcash is jolly and max speed. So that gives it an amazing stat of 240 speed, which manages to outspeed the Gross. I EQ the Gross, kill that, and then I 2 it KO the Pharaoh because he didn't have Power Whip. So go, go, Whizcash! Great debut! Pulling it out like a trooper. See? See? Oh, you. Yeah, Whizcash doesn't give a fuck. That is good game, sir. I hope you enjoyed awesome Whizcash ownage, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.